Hi guys, it's Naya. Welcome back to my channel. So today I will be showing you this wig from Kali. I cannot pronounce it. Kali. 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 It is a 360 wig and I decided to go ahead and put it into a ponytail. This hair is so dense, like, oh my gosh, I love it. It is full from root to tip. I wanted a 360 because I wanted to put it into a ponytail. I love this hair so much and I hope that you guys too, so let's get into the video. So this is a box and inside of it comes a wig cap, the hair, of course, and also it comes with masks. You guys, it came with a bunch of masks. They gave me two packets of masks and that is so essential during this time, so... Thank you for that, but let's get into this hair. So this is a 360, so right here I was just showing that to you guys. And this is the lace, this is all my, y'all, it comes with baby hairs, okay? So like I said, it comes with baby hairs and I believe it is pre-plucked, but like I said, the links and everything will be in the D box. And I just wanted to show you guys how deep this parting space is, you guys. Oh my goodness gracious. And just keep in mind, I did not bleach the knots. So what I did was I just took a beauty blender with some makeup on it and I put it on the inside of the wig and this is how it looks. So right now I'm just going to start to install it. And I'm going to start by putting the hair into a ponytail and cutting away any excess lace. So first I just like to cut off a big piece of the lace just to get it away from my eyelashes. So that's usually the first thing that I do. Right now I'm just pulling out the baby hairs just to see and place the wig where I want it to lay. And then later on I'm just going to go in like you see here with my scissors and cut off any excess lace. And I'm going to start to apply my wig with my, what kind of glue do I use? Let's see. So I noticed that there were a bit too much flyaways um, and that was going to get in the way if I were to glue the wig down. So I just went in with my mousse, any mousse really, and I'm just slicking the hair back. Now I'm going in with my ghost bond glue. We are going back to basics today. I'm just going to put one layer of glue around my head and then I'm going to use the back of my tweezers to smooth it out. So now I'm just applying the wig and literally you just want to pull your lace forward and place it on top of that glue. Um, be careful, try to just get the lace down and don't smudge in the hairs. So what I do like to do is I just like to go in and comb back any um, hair and I just like to go in between the hair and push the lace down into my skin. And then I'm going to use the end of the comb as well to pull out any baby hairs. So I'm about to do my baby hairs and if you guys would like a dedicated baby hair tutorial then just comment that down below so I can make it for you guys. So now I'm going to take my got to be freeze basting spray and I'm going to spray that over the part. And I'm going to go over that with a hot comb again. This seals it in place, you guys. This literally locks your hair in place. After that, I'm going to use my LA Girls Pro Conceal in the shade Fawn and lightly go over any parting space. And we are finished. you guys I actually forgot to film an outro for this video but if you would like to see this hair live and in action then I suggest heading over to my YouTube tips and tricks playlist and check out five more things that I wish that I knew when starting a YouTube channel it's that video on that note thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe have your post notifications on because we are doing a giveaway my Instagram is down below and I'll see you guys in my next video Bye. All these fears make me stronger. I suffer no longer. The harder the fight, the victory sweet. We just say.